Watching TV, surfing the internet, chatting with friends over the phone are activities that we take for granted in our everyday lives. All of them have one thing in common. They are made possible through the power of satellite technology. SES operates one of the largest satellite fleets in the world and employs more than 1,000 professionals spread across the globe. Today, satellite communications is a central element in the fast-growing communications industry across Europe, North and Latin America, Africa and Asia. The rising demand for high-definition TV and pay TV content in Asia, for example, has spurred the need for more extensive satellite coverage. Yet few appreciate the complexity and effort that goes into constructing a satellite, launching it into space and putting it into operation. When constructing a satellite, SES collaborates closely with its carefully selected partners, like Astrium of France. Every stage of the construction of a satellite requires an incredibly high level of care and precision because once the satellite is in space, there's no way to repair it if something goes wrong. A crucial phase in the construction of a satellite is in the coupling of the communication and service sections, as this is when the satellite takes shape for the first time. When this uh, communication module will be lift over the service module that will come in the middle, we visually check that there is no clash or no problem to make sure uh, that it will be okay because then it should work during 15 years and it's not in orbit that we can go to fix a cable or anything, right? So we need to be very careful on the ground and retest everything to make sure everything is fine. Every component required for operating the satellite is duplicated. Should one system fail in space, the backup will come into play. This is the only way to ensure that the satellite will stay operational for 15 years. In the final phase of construction, vital signal dishes are fitted onto the satellite. Before it's launched into space, every aspect of the satellite will be carefully checked and tested over a period of six months. This is the only way to ensure that the satellite will perform its intended functions over the next 15 years. State-of-the-art technology enables SES's high-performance satellites to transmit hundreds of TV channels to an entire continent. The reach of our satellites is also helping to connect people even in the most remote locations and achieve reliable global communications. The satellite's journey to its launch site requires a massive logistical effort and once the satellite reaches the launch site, the most exciting phase of the process begins. The rocket launch. The responsibility for putting the satellite safely in space lies with Martin Hallowell, CTO of SES, and his team. What we're doing is we're uh, checking the uh, thermal situation for the satellite, make sure all the temperatures are correct, either for the batteries or for the tanks or the various different technical elements inside the satellite. We're also checking that the batteries are fully charged and that we're all ready for launch. For a smooth launch, every technical detail must be carried out perfectly. The journey to the launch pad is an amazing sight and a risky operation in itself. The rocket and its payload will take an hour to cover two and a half kilometers. Once it has reached the launch pad, the preparations for countdown can finally begin. There's about eight hours left um, before liftoff, and uh, my colleagues over in the other building are actually um, working to configure the satellite and uh, monitoring it and testing it to make sure that uh, everything is set to go. The tension will go down uh, when we have separation of the, the satellite from the launcher and we see that the orbit is correct. It will go completely away when I see that we have a signal from the satellite, which should be about five minutes after separation. The launch is a success. An almost inconceivable thrust of 30 million horsepower, equal to that from 40 Airbus A380 engines, lifts the rocket into the skies. Across the globe, SES manages four satellite operations centers from where the satellites are controlled and operated. Their main task is to precisely monitor all the data transmitted to and from the satellites, which remain in geostationary orbit. A geostationary orbit is one in which the satellite travels at the same angular speed as the Earth. It means the satellite seems to be in a fixed position in front of the dish on the wall of your house, so to speak. That's why you can receive programs. Our task here is to ensure that the satellite really is in that position. If a satellite moves by even a tenth of a degree, customers may not receive the signal transmission. To ensure that the satellite is in the proper location, the controllers monitor over 15,000 values a minute from each satellite every day 
and all year round. The engineers need to react immediately whenever a value falls out of acceptable range. Today, SES transmits more than 5,000 TV programs for various markets worldwide, more than any other provider. The staff at SES Digital Networks Operation Center in Luxembourg are responsible for monitoring program quality. They check all the TV signals that are transmitted to the satellites and then received again on Earth and ensure that the reliability of the signal should never fall below 99.9997%. Modern satellite technology is the most reliable and cost-effective means of covering large geographic regions. With its expanding fleet of satellites, SES reaches virtually all of the world's population, enabling truly global connections at any time and from anywhere. Satellites are the ideal channel for transmitting massive quantities of digital data. This makes them particularly suitable for broadcasting high-definition TV programs and for providing high-speed broadband internet access. SES is at the forefront of the latest developments in digital TV technology, mobile connectivity and global network communications. With our extensive experience in satellite systems, dedicated professionals and leading edge technology, SES makes modern communications possible across the world.